There's absolutely no need for skyscrapers. They're a sheer uh, fantasy of the uh, American uh, bourgeoisie, and uh, I find them absolutely delightful because uh, the more skyscrapers I build, the more uh, it strains the neck a bit, but it's, uh, it, it's pleasant to see them growing like a, a good asparagus bed. It's like we finally have architecture out of the closet. People are interested. People are wanting to make films like this. People are, are uh, reading and writing. and It's the most amazing time. It's the most interesting time for architecture. I think the price is between satisfying one's own um, inner needs and uh, satisfying paying the bills. I have to do it. It's not a question of whether I want to experiment. It's it's in my nature to do it. So I, uh, I'm I guess I'm willing to pay the price. No building in recent years has inspired such interest, enthusiasm, and controversy. Government buildings are known for their dullness. The Portland building certainly is not dull. It's been called so many things during these past few months, a giant jukebox, a circus tent, or a touch of architectural genius that breaks the bland mold of modernism. My skin has gotten very, very thick uh, with some of the bricks that have been thrown. But nevertheless, it's, we can at least have access to its imagery. If somebody sees something in it, whether it's good, bad, or indifferent, they see something. It's not an austere glass box, finally.